Ralph Little, who is best known for his leading role in Death in Paradise, has lamented that acting is a mentally tough profession where has repeatedly been rejected over and over again. The 42-year-old also explained there had been an awful moment when he was hosting legend Ian McKellen's party three years ago. The two pints of lager and a packet of crisps actor cringed that he felt a little awkward when he went back to his former school in Bolton to host the ceremony. He revealed, a surprise birthday bash was thrown at my school in the Arts Centre and I was asked to host that and introduce it. Judy Dench was there, and, all these legends of theatre and Terry Smee going evening everyone. What am I doing here? He exclaimed while on Kate Thornton's White Wine Question Time podcast. He also recalled another awful moment when a year three student froze and completely forgot his lines during a theatre production of Shakespeare's Merchant of Venice hosted especially for the party. Ralph remembered that Ian didn't skip a beat and seamlessly filled in for the young boy to prevent his awkward silence. He knows the lines from everything. An impressed Ralph marveled. The star elaborated on other moments, beside the party, when Head had an awkward experience, due to the various pitfalls of being a working actor. It's basically a profession where you get rejected over and over again, it messes with your head. He exclaimed. A succinct way to put that across to people is instead of calling it an audition, call it a job interview, because most people will have a handful of job interviews in their entire life and they'll be really important ones. They'll probably stress about it or whatever, but, every audition is a job interview. Ralph continued. He added, I'm not in a position to go, I never need to work again. Everyone on TV in America is a millionaire, whereas living in the UK, that's not the case. Until you're Ryan Gosling, until you're that level, Terry's this nagging feeling of what if this is the last job we get? He concluded of the mentally tough profession, that, feeling, is woven into the fabric of what we do. Has had some notable highs, including handing Coldplay their first ever Brit Award, and regards himself as lucky. However, he sometimes struggles with his profession requiring him to get validation externally instead of from within. Ralph previously admitted that losing his older sister in a tragic accident when he was just nine years old may lie behind his constant drive for perfection. Carrie, then 14, tragically fell from a cliff during a family camping holiday in Cornwall, and never regained consciousness. A devastated Ralph never had therapy to come to terms with how the bereavement made him feel, and now believes it has given him a complex. Desperate to control events to help him overcome the major one had been unable to change. He described his demeanor as a teenager as fiercely competitive to the point of being psychotic. You think, I can't do anything about death, so what shall I do instead? My way of rebelling against the hand I'd been dealt was to excel at everything, he sadly told the Times. Death in Paradise airs tonight on BBC One at 9pm.